Alright, now we're working in revisions. This is where it can get kind of interesting. So, we have revision A right here. When we're working on revision A, how do we make revision B and just give it an idea a little bit different on the drawing just for some technique that they want to see. So, first things first, we must go in and we must open up this part. So, we hit right button click open. Now we build with the family table. In the family table we're now going to build an instance. Uh, off of this instance it's the first button Frank, not the second. Here we want to call this thing B. So scroll over, remove A, and put a capital B. Underneath this name, under part uh, 020, what? I have no idea what they're doing there. That's kind of weird under commons. Under commons, you can actually give it this name back. But let's say, if you want, you can verify. Verify the unit. And then say OK. Then, once you have said, said OK, we have that instance. Now we're going to go over and get even trickier. We're going to go over here to the drawing. Inside this drawing right here, we're going to save it as a copy. This one's going to have the regular notes. The second one's going to have a whole table in location for it. So let's take in, we'll go into the location on this and we'll say, OK, file, save as copy. We're going to copy this name, paste it into location, and remove the A and replace it with the B. We're going to say OK. Once we do that, we're on A. So we need to say OK, just hit Save on A, and then go over and open B. This is where it gets kind of tricky. So we say B. Once we open up B, then we have to manage the part. And this is where it gets kind of interesting how it works. So under Drawing Models, we're going to replace the A with the B. So we touch Replace, and we replace it with B. We say open, and we say done. Now, what you have done is you replaced it with B, which could be a different configuration that could have different whole patterns, uh, could have totally different whole sets, different things like that. But only thing that we want to do on this drawing, it's our B drawing. We can hit save once. We want to actually take all the location holes out. We don't need these anymore. On these right here, we're going to bleed them out. Is what we're going to do is we're going to actually put in what? We're going to put in hold tables for the top of this part. Don't take out your side ones. Those are OK. You can just move them over. We want to get space for a hold table. So where is that space going to be? I'm going to try to tuck it in the corner. So if I tuck over here and tuck in the corner for it. Let's see what we can do. So off of this like this, we're going to go table. Now over here is whole table. When you pick up whole table, it's going to ask you, well, you're wanting the whole table for it, and then you're going to create that whole table. When it picks up for the whole table, it's saying select coordinate system for this listing. Turn your coordinate systems on. And the one that you want to select is this bottom corner here. It's the one that I have green. Select that one into location. And then once you've done that, select the top left corner of the table. So top left corner, we're going to tuck it in the corner here. And there's your table for your profiles. What it does is it tags every hole. It tags them with an A6, A5, A4, A1, all the way 
throughout the whole profile of the design. Only thing left that you have to do on this is right button click, right button click, select this column, and then we want to change the width of the column. On the width of the column, let's go with a 1.1. .1. Hit OK. All right, turn the datums off. Once those datums are off, we have the new technique with the whole table, and that one's ready to go. Only thing that you might want to do is change this. Uh, if you want to, you can change the text or anything like that or color, but I like it. It looks good. Uh, this one right here, base plate with whole table if you want for the title. So go into tables, double click, say confirm, and then con whole table. Now hit OT. And if you notice this, watch what happens. Down here, this one is reading what? The part parameter as an A. So this gets kind of tricky. You're like, what? If I hit there and I say check, that's drawing number. That's the parameter. So what we might have to do is we might have to open up the original part. So the original part is what? the original part right here you'd want that one to have different parameter names for itself so that's the scenario that you want for B to have so B would have the different parameters so this one would be a B so gotta click on it there confirm and get in the B and hit check now you can create your PDF and location. So you would say what? Rebuild, save, file, save as, save it as a PDF, and make sure you put your initials in there when you do this. So, boop, 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 and hit save. That will produce the one with the whole table and all the tags for each one of the holes and you're good as gold. So those are the two assignments that you get done and we're done. Uh, this one takes a short amount of time but yet it takes a longer amount of time. So you just got to be really careful going across on the design. Talk to you guys later. Have a good day.